It is 8.45 p.m. And as you can see, it is pitch black outside. I tried shining a light out there and you can't see anything. It's just bouncing off the... Um, I can see it, but you can't because of the screen. But it's pitch black outside now. And I have my little lights on. Little LED lights. Thank you, Sheila, for um, giving me the certificate for... Um, gift certificate for Home Depot. I was able to buy these lights as well as the screen here that that is um, allowing me to keep the mosquitoes out I decided to move the tent um, it was set up over here and there was no room to walk then I set it on the bed but then there was no room to lay down so I set it over here temporarily um, so far I've had like maybe one mosquito buzzing around me I have a um, fly swatter but I left it in the, um, the van that was pretty stupid and I'm not going out there to get it now because I know if I open this door There'll be a million mosquitoes all over me. So right now I don't see them coming in. Um, the guys that were riding around on the ATV, they, um, well, I think I'm having a hard time focusing here. The guys that were riding around on the ATV, they had uh, um, stopped making all the noise a while ago. But I can hear like a sound in the distance. I don't know if it's a generator or something. It sounds mechanical. Like, like a humming sound. But uh, as far as inside the yurt, I know that it's hard to see here because um, I can see it. It's weird. The camera doesn't pick up very well with this light, with the LED light. But um, my eyes can see. And right now it's got the, uh, the camera light. The camera flash is on there. I do have the um, fan here hooked up to the battery pack so I can turn it on by um, connecting the, uh, the red right there to the uh, battery and then it turns on which actually makes it very comfortable um now it's kind of scary right now because it's like quiet and i can hear the um the wilderness and i haven't really slept out in the open like this in a long long time but um every once in a while you hear gunshots so i think people are out here hunting oh i just saw a mosquito buzzing by but anyhow um when i was laying here earlier and i had the radio on I don't want to turn it on right now because of YouTube violations. And I had the fan on, and I was just laying here, looking up at the ceiling, kind of like this. And with the fan on, let me go ahead and turn the fan on here. It's, it's actually, um... I came loose here. It's a makeshift uh, plug right there. And it's also got a USB charger, and I got a little light here that I can flip on. You can tell that it's on with this light. But see the fans on right now? I don't know if you can hear it. But it is so nice right now. I think it's more comfortable sleeping in here than it is inside the van. It's kind of, um, it's, it feels really cool with the fan blowing right on me like that. I'm debating if I even need windows. Windows would be nice during the day for breeze and stuff, but the problem is at night, mosquitoes can get in. It just gives more room for mosquitoes and bugs and other animals to get in. And I already have the, the screen net up at the door. But it's um, very cozy in here. And with the music, I feel I can actually relax a little bit. When I have it off, um, I can hear the nature, I can hear the crickets and other animals, which I guess is supposed to be soothing, but it's kind of scary. Hi, <laughs> because I'm not used to it yet. You know, you can hear the crickets and stuff like you're camping. And every once in a while you hear that, uh, what is that, the skunk ape or something? Making it roaring sound. But um, anyhow, I just wanted to update you guys. Uh, it is pitch black outside. And my plan tonight is just to lay here in bed and chill and listen to the radio. I might try to read a magazine or something. Or I can crank up my laptop, which I did bring with me um, from the van. And maybe watch a movie or something, then call it a night. Because <laughs> it's almost 10 right now. It's like 9.30. So 
So if I watch a movie, it'll be about 11 or 12. And then I can just go to bed. And then um, wake up with breakfast. I haven't totally unpacked my van, so I don't know what's all left in there. But I, I had bought a, um, a butane cooker that I can't seem to find. I don't know what I did with it. It was supposed, to, it was meant to come out, you know, to be left at the yurt, to be used. And now I can't find it. But, um, I'm really impressed with how nice it is out here. The fan over here just feels so nice and cool right now. I think it's cooler being in here than it is being in a van. At night. Probably because the metal may hold heat or something. I don't know. Or you're on asphalt, you know, you're on the street. But out here in the woods, it cooled down really fast. And it felt really nice. And then when I turn on the fan, it's super cool. So it's very possible to sleep out here. Of course, I haven't put, um... I haven't put grass along the edges, you know, along the outside of the, um the yurt yet, so I don't know if that'll make a difference or not. Right now it's just a thin layer of tarp protecting me from the elements and the animals. I have to not tell myself, or I have to get myself to forget that, that the only thing keeping me from outside is the tarp. <laughs> but then I remind myself that the animals that we hear, or I hear, they're out there in the wild with nothing, and they're fine. The snakes, the um, skunk ape, the arm armadillo, I just heard something. Yeah, sounded like guns. I don't know if it's gun or fireworks. It is Friday, um, and what is it, June 30th? So July 4th is coming up, so maybe some people may be firing fireworks, or they might just be um, shooting out here, because it is the weekend, and people do hunt out here or come shooting. I guess they hunt at night. Hopefully hunt those wild boars that are making grunting sounds at me. Anyhow, um, my tent is there if I need it. If the mosquitoes get too bad right now, I only saw one and I think I squashed it. I don't know if I got it or not, but it went away after I swung my hand at it. I don't see any more buzzing around me, which when I was at um, the, um, the hut, and I stepped outside and it was pitch black like this, they swarmed all over me. So the yurt is actually keeping them out. Or at least that's what it feels like right now. I did see a bug just land on me. I don't know if you just saw it fly across the screen here. That was not a mosquito, it was some kind of flying bug. I don't know if it was an ant or some other bug. They may be attracted to the light, so. Anyhow, I'm gonna go ahead and, um, I might even turn that light off right there. And just put on some music and just relax and chill over here. But this is a little nice uh, place to camp. It is 9 p.m. And I can hear something outside. There's some kind of animal walking around. It's like stepping through the branches, breaking them. I think it can hear me too. Of course with me running this camera that can definitely see the light through the yurt. I would think it would see it shining right at the um, the wall here. But I just heard the animal right outside. Seems like it got quiet now. <laughs> 